More and more riders are embracing the opportunity to ride their quads in the winter months. Being dressed for the conditions is obviously a priority, but having your vehicle prepared for the cold and snow is something that needs to be done to avoid mechanical issues. As for the ride, keep in mind that unless you're on a trail system groomed and set up for ATVs in the winter, riding in deep snow can pose its own set of problems steering or even getting traction in the real deep stuff. Traction has been handled by the multitude of track systems, but for steering there's been little choice unless you fit both front and back with the track systems. That is until a company from Wisconsin introduced us to an ATV winter steering system that can be put on and off your ATV quickly and easily. The system is called Snow Cobra. Here's how the Snow Cobra test went, which included a rear track system to increase traction for us in the winter conditions. Different from tracks, the Snow Cobra is a ski that goes on the front of the machine. Now, generally, if you're going to be in deep snow, you're still going to want tracks on the rear of the ATV. There's just no way in two or three feet of snow that tires are going to get you the momentum that you need. But having skis on the front is an interesting concept. These are a composite material, lightweight, double carbides on the bottom, and believe it or not, they are just fantastic to steer. You can go just about anywhere you want to go. There's not much that's going to stop you. The sights, the sounds that you're going to see in the winter time are just fantastic. Room trails not required. The skis on the front actually allow you to get quite a bit more speed and fuel mileage is substantially better. Without the front tracks having been driven by the four-wheel drive system, the machine is actually able to use less fuel, making your ability to go on longer trips more of a plus. Handling was solid and flotation was good while riding with the Snow Cobra system in open fields. Heading into the wooded section did pose some concerns amongst the trees. One of the few disadvantages that we did find with the skis, obviously, is reverse. You've only got a few inches of reverse to get you out of a situation before the skis dig in. Now maybe there's some plans in the future to add something to the rear end of the ski to make it possible to reverse, but for now you pretty much need to drive your ATV like it was a snowmobile. Having reported on our reverse gear concerns, we've been told by the company that this backing up issue is being addressed and will be rectified. <laughs>